You want to be your own boss. You want to decide how much you're worth. You're tired of somebody telling you, hey, you, you're worth 15 bucks an hour or you're worth 40,000 bucks a year or 50,000 bucks a year or, or whatever this label is, whatever this amount is they put on you and decide your worth. You want to take back that control. You want to say, hey, I'm worth this because I've learned these skills. I add this value to other people's lives and I'm worth a lot more. Welcome back to your digital mindset on this channel. We are devoted to the online entrepreneur, your online business, and most importantly, your mindset. Like I say, I'm getting a lot of this lately is I don't have, I don't have a lot of time. I don't have a lot of time to spend trying to build my own business, trying to make money online. You know, I'm just a busy person and I get it. My first advice for that is to make some time. Okay. And I know, especially when I first started my business, I would wake up in the middle of the night and I would just stay up. Okay, because I mean, you've got to want it. If you can't find hours during the day, then you've got to make your time. Maybe it's early in the morning. Maybe it's late in the evening. Maybe it's both. Maybe it's on your lunch breaks. Maybe it's, you know, whenever you're t- taking a break throughout your day. Whenever you can find time, whenever you can make time, that's your time. And this is going to be an ongoing series. Today, we're going to touch on, like I mentioned in the very beginning, mindset. Okay, get your mindset right. And they're going to talk about ways to make money online going forward through 2022 and beyond. Okay, now it all start it all starts with mindset. That's why my brand is your digital mindset. We're talking about the mindset of the digital marketer, the online entrepreneur. It takes a certain mindset to be successful with an online business. Like I just said, getting up earlier, staying up later, doing it at lunch, doing it whenever you can find time to do it and making time. That's a digital mindset. That's a mindset of the digital marketer. It's that I'm going to figure out how to get it done and I'm never going to quit. I'm going to be successful. That's what it takes. And a lot of people come into this and this might be you and that's okay at the beginning, but you got to cultivate this, this other mindset, this digital mindset. A lot of people come into it going, I don't know if I can do it. I just don't know. I mean, I don't have enough time. I don't have enough money. I, I don't have enough support. Nobody believes in any, everybody thinks that this is, you know, won't work, blah, blah, blah. All these reasons. Okay. You've got to get away from that. That's the old way. That's what got you in this position right now where you're watching this video going, man, I do want to make money online. I do want to make money in my spare time, but I just don't know what to do next. I do, I've seen all these videos. I've watched all, you know, seen all these, these, these uh, ebooks, all this stuff. What do I do now? And if you're watching that video, that means you want something more than what you have right now. You want to be your own boss. You want to decide how much you're worth. You're tired of somebody telling you, hey, you, you're worth 15 bucks an hour or you're worth 40,000 bucks a year or 50,000 bucks a year or, or whatever this label is, whatever this amount is they put on you and decide your worth. You want to take back that control. You want to say, hey, I'm worth this because I've learned these skills. I add this value to other people's lives and I'm worth a lot more. So you've made that decision. You've at least made enough of a decision to watch this video and watch other videos like it more than likely and say, I want to be my own boss. I want to take control of my future and my family's future. So that's first. Okay. At least you've got that part of the mindset down. You're seeking it. You're seeking more. And then from that point, then you start cultivating a more entrepreneurial mindset where you start learning new skills and meeting new people and surrounding yourself with other online entrepreneurs. I'm telling you, as soon as you get the right mindset, you realize that you've got to start surrounding yourself with other online entrepreneurs. That's the only way to grow. And I'm gonna tell you this, if you didn't get nothing else out of this video today is know this is that you will never succeed like you want to, like you expect to, like you need it to happen. You'll never do it alone. Okay. Cause I tried it for years and most people did anybody that you see all these gurus online, they had help along the way. They got a mentor. They joined, they joined programs. They surrounded themselves with other online entrepreneurs when at the time had more than they had would show them the way, not give them a hand out, but a hand up. I mean, it's, it's paramount. I cannot be any more emphatic about anything else I say today, which I'll say several things, but that you can't do it alone. You've got to be around other online entrepreneurs. You've got to join a team. And I'm not saying join my team. If I'm speaking your language, join my team. If I'm not, that's okay. Join whoever else's video or podcast or whoever, whoever's speaking your language, whatever platform, whether it be a video, a podcast, an ebook or whatever, whatever it is, join them, join their community, join their online family, whoever it is. If it's me, great. We want to have you as part of our online family because that's what got me over the hump. When I finally realized, man, I'm getting nowhere alone. I've been at this for years, just, you know, dabbling at it and just, you know, messing with it here and there. And I saw no results. Okay. Now I finally said, 
they, this group of people have got it going on. I'm going to join them because they seem to know what they're doing. And they had all the stuff that I needed, that I knew I personally needed to grow my business with training and tools and all that stuff. But then, but they were the people. Okay, I went and got involved with them. I went to a convention. I, I surrounded myself with them. And granted, we're just getting back into that again now, but it can't happen now. You can't surround yourself. So here's the deal. They said that you become an average of the five people that you spend the most time with. And that's online or offline. So if you're spending all your time in your off, offline environment with people that have no desire for themselves to grow online, to have a successful online business, but they also have no desire to see you do it either. They talk you out of it. They throw negative energy all your way. If that's all you're getting from other people that are not, that are in your immediate group, that's where you're going to end up. You're going to stay right there, probably where you're at now. And I'm not saying cut out the people that you love, cut them out of your life. I'm saying you got to minimize that and start supplementing their input with other positive people, people who are where you want to be, people who know the things that you need to know to be successful. Start surrounding yourself with those types of people. As I'm saying this, I can't be any more serious about that part of it is figure out who's speaking your language, whether it be a single influencer, trainer, mentor, whatever, and their aligned group, community, family, and, and buy in and go all in and don't give up until ne never. Okay. That's my mindset. That's part of that mindset is no quit. It's I will not quit ever because I see so many people. This is back in the beginning. I mean, I'm having success now. You can see this award up here. It's not to brag. I'm just letting you know that in the beginning, you have to adopt that I'm never going to quit because so many people are successful and continue to do it every day. I hear this all the time. Well, man, it's saturated. There's so many people have an online business. No, they don't. One to two percent max that watch these videos do anything about anything. They just watch videos and read ebooks and, you know, watch and view and just think about it. But if you're an action taker like I am and like hopefully you are because you're ready to take that next step, then you say, you know what? There's room for me because there is. And there'll be another one right behind you and behind that person. Because there's, again, 98% of the people who watch these videos say, I'm an online entrepreneur. They're not doing anything about it. They're just learning. And knowledge without action is useless. You say knowledge is power? No, it's not. Action is power. Even with mistakes from action is power because that's a lesson. So I don't want to get on a soapbox, but I want to, I just want to, I want to drill that home in this first episode of this ongoing series that I'm going to be doing on how to make money in your spare time is first, it's get your mindset right. Join an online family. Again, if it's mine, there's a link down below. If it's not mine, that's cool too. Join somebody, but do that soon. Now, this is going to help you get your mindset right, regardless of what team you join, because this is going to help you go into it going, I am capable of anything. There's two ways, okay? This is what really just lit my fire. You can tell I'm excited about it. I watched this years ago. If you watch this video, I can guarantee you when this video you're watching with me right now, telling you to watch this other video is going to change your life starting today. No doubt about it. And I want you to come back and comment whether it's 30 days, 14 days, 60 days, whatever. Give it 30 days. If it hasn't, come back and comment. If it has, I want to hear about that too. But go watch this video. There'll be a link down below. It'll take you to this video by Earl Nightingale. This is super powerful. This will help you get started. It's only 30 minutes. You, you, know, you skip one Netflix series that you're watching, one Ozark or whatever you're watching. Skip that one and watch this. Okay, and this will change your It makes you realize how powerful you are. And you don't have to be a genius. Just if you take action, if you realize how powerful you are by saying, hey, if I decide I'm going to do it and I do it, then I can have anything. That video will help you understand that. The next thing is, is with, if you have Amazon Prime, which most people do, but if you don't, if you do have it, then you can watch Napoleon Hill's Master Key. This is taken from his book called Think and Grow Rich. And what's cool about it is you might say, oh, well, that's about making money. Sure, but we're, we're trying to have an online business here, so that's great. But this is also true for anything you want to do. I don't care if you just want to be a better mother, father, teacher, student, whatever you want to be better at. If you want to be the best version of yourself, this it's a sh there's short little videos about 12 12 minutes each. Okay, and there's like 12 or 13 videos, but you can just do it you know piecemeal at a time, and you have some spare time again. I'm telling you between that video there by Earl Nightingale and Napoleon Hill's Master Key to Success, that'll change your life you'll understand going forward that you can accomplish anything you want to accomplish. Okay. That's how we're going to start this series of how to make money in your spare time. Right now we're talking about mindset and understanding how powerful you are. In the next episode, we will dig into 
specific ways to start making money online. If you got any questions, drop them down below. And again, if you want to join our team, that link's down below too. Chaz here, your original mindset, and I can't wait to see you on the inside. Thanks a lot.